On behalf of AWS, I'm here uh, for the uh, Justice Public Safety Team to talk about our cloud offerings and how we're partnering with Magnum on some of their new offerings. Excellent, excellent. So, you know, one of the main challenges we're seeing today with law enforcement and government is really the complexity and the data volumes just always increasing. So maybe you can talk a little bit about how you're helping public safety customers today. You know, it's not just 911 recordings, but it's computers and cell phones and now IoT devices and social media. And the agencies have to have some means of storing this data, but also analyzing it. They need to share it quickly bet between uh, different teams on their organizations, and they need to do it securely and safely. So that's where we come in. We provide tools to secure that data and, and, and make it easier to share and distribute that amongst the, the stakeholders. Absolutely, and that's something that's really important with Magnet Review and our collaboration platform of that digital evidence of being able to get it out to your stakeholders and being able to get Magnet Review in AWS makes that just much, much easier so that I can share it with my detectives and investigators and our prosecutors without having to copy things to USBs and then have to mail them or you know track them down to provide them that kind of old technology when we can do this in the cloud that's much, much faster and safer. Yeah, that, that sneaker net uh, method that you're talking about is just absolutely ineffective and, and inefficient and frankly insecure. And uh, windshield time driving these devices around town is, is, is a really bad way of doing it and frankly is, is slowing down the criminal justice process. Can you talk a little bit about the security that AWS offers? AWS is very unique in, in our, um, our approach to, to data security. We have Nitro Hypervisor, for instance, and our KMS, our key management service, and our multi-factor authentication helps lock down our customers' data so that our employees can't see it. And that's unique to, to Amazon. Other cloud providers don't have the same approach, and I, and I think that that's one of the reasons that some agencies have been apprehensive in putting things in the cloud, because in other cases, uh, cloud service provider personnel can see what they're what they're storing in their cloud and that just there really is no need for a cloud employee to be able to see what customers are putting in the cloud especially when it comes to digital evidence it's a chain of custody issue and, and basically a digital evidence integrity issue to, to have eyes on that information that shouldn't see it obviously security comes up all the time can you talk a little bit about CGIS and how AWS supports CGIS data we have a real strong team at, at AWS on the Justice and Public Safety team. We've quadrupled our level of, of employees that focus on this, subject subject matter experts and post practitioners in this area. One of the areas that we've invested heavily with, as far as uh, staff is CGIS compliance. We have a CGIS expert on our team that does nothing but CGIS compliance and also a couple other resources that, that we've, one of them was hired directly from the FBI CGIS security division. And everything that we're talking about as far as the data in this area would be stored in AWS GovCloud, which is CGIS compliant. We'll meet all those, those compliance requirements needed. Well, if customers want to learn more about Magnet Forensics and the AWS partnership, you can head over to magnetforensics.com and look at our partnerships. Uh, but thank you all for joining us today. Thank you.